Hello everyone, it's Brett here, Lionheart84, and I just thought sort we'd of have a quick look. Update on my Chilean guava. This one is Ugly Molinai Flambo. This is the variegated one. It's not quite as hardy as the plain green one, but I just wanted to show you that these, what I call half hardy, um, sort of not quite subtropical, but these sort of rare evergreens from... Uh, slightly warmer climates tend to when they do get cold damage as this one got before christmas early in december we got minus seven it, it actually didn't look too bad for three or four weeks but now we're into the middle of february you can see the extent of the damage and the dieback um, looks quite a poor state to be honest um, but it doesn't they don't show the damage Immediately, it can take several weeks. I'm going to take a step back and show you my Myers lemon as well. Is it a Myers lemon? My Myers lemon. I think you can see now just how bad this is. Now it does look to me as if the very low down stems um, probably have some signs of life with them. So there is a possibility of regeneration from lower down on the plant. But the uh, the main part of the lemon is absolutely totally dead, and this has taken this was put down in 2018. It's taken four years to grow to this size from a, a smaller plant, so it's a bit unfortunate that it hasn't proved as cold resistant as I was hoping it was going to be. But then I wasn't expecting to get the freak cold uh, winter that we had this year. So that's my Myers lemon. I'm just to follow up a little bit this is the final cold damage you can now see on my bottle brush the level of damage this is now taken this is very very dead looking there is a likelihood that these stems at the top are absolutely totally dead but I'm thinking that the main stems right down at the base probably will be okay but all of these stems here are completely and utterly dead there's not a hint of green anywhere on them totally dead and these are quite a reasonably hardy little um, plant bottle brush in normal winters but not this year and carrying on the theme this is another Agni Molinai this is Kapow all of this top growth is dead here uh, the one next to it, which is a regular Chilean Guava Agni Molinai. Top growth is all dead on it. Um, the Yuzu, top growth now all totally dead. Strawberry Guava behind it, completely died back to the base. Um, it's been a harsh it's been a harsh exposure this year unfortunately for a lot of these um, what are considered to be semi hardy plants but the guav Chilean guavas I would imagine will come back from lower down but if you snap these top stems there's no green in them whatsoever so the top of the plants definitely dead but the leaves further down look I won't really know till about March or April when they start to shoot out but I'm going to be cutting obviously a lot of this dead growth off and hopefully we will see some recovery on them but it's just an indication of um, having too much expectation when we get these extremely cold winters that crop up occasionally no problem with the uh, pineapple guavas they've been absolutely fine not at all but uh, certainly the in-ground citrus I experimented with and the um, Chilean guavas, not a positive result at all. Anyway, thanks for watching the video, much appreciate it. Please give me a thumbs up. Again, uh, you're welcome to share the video. You can subscribe to my channel and click on the bell if you like updates on new videos when they come out. I'll catch up with you all soon. Brett out for now.